Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As usually, I'm gonna show you the Fototon and also the cars I've been using for the championship. Now, we are at winter, so let's have a look what we need to do. First of all, we need to take a picture with a hypercar at Moorhead Windmill. Now, where is that located? It's located here. You don't see it very well, um, but it's pretty okay. It's actually here. It really doesn't matter, you can just put your car somewhere and get a hypercar and just make a picture and you will have it. That's all. Then, let's go to the Fortaton shop. We have the Buick GSX and we have the Nissan Nismo. That's, well, I have a, I made this one to a drift car, it drifts really good and this one, it's an overall nice car to drive with. Then, let's have a look at the Fortaton. We need the 2011 BMW 1 Series M Coupe. We need to win two road sprint events, 500 skill scores, and we just need to cruise. Now, it's very simple. Here at the Esmore Heritage Circuit, you can just go there. Because it's snow, the car is not tuned for snow. I didn't want that because we don't need it. You can just go to custom blueprints and this is the code type it in all the thing you need to do is drive straight um it's summer so no problems do that twice and you're fine then we need to have 500 skill scores um it's simple greendale airstrip Now, since it's snowing, it's very easy. The car has a multiplier of 5. Uh, you can actually see here, car mastery. Don't forget to put your stuff on. Maybe if you hit something, so you can always put these things on. And what you need to do, you just go here and then you drift a little bit, you hit stuff. It doesn't really matter. Um, the multiplier goes to 5. So you just need a hundred thousand. I think I stopped at ninety-five thousand, if I can remember good. I just do the route I've been doing for more than, well, I don't know, for two years now, I guess. You just go like this, and then you will get it. Then the next one is also very simple. Just drive, cruise it, uh, fifteen miles or twenty-four kilometers. That's basically all you need to do for the phototon. Very easy. Now here you see the trial modern race suit gray. Let's have a look what we need for that. I'll put the road racing series off. There you go. So we need Evo vs Impreza. It's road and we need B700. So let's have a look. I'll do it this way. Um, so I chose every car. There you go. So you see, these are um, all free cars you can get. Now, I'm not a fan of these cars simply because the transmission is really... Uh, well, I don't like the transmission of the car. It's like... <laughs> now, what can you use for this? Well, I have been using um, the 2005. Let's have a quick look. To be sure, I'm not really sure now at the moment. So let's go to the Mitsubishi. And the one that I have is the B class. No, I think it's the Evo then. Let's have a look at. Ah, no, no, no. I take the Subarus. I take the Subarus. Apologies. Um. This one, this one is a very good one, but it's not on B-Class. Uh, where is my B-Class? Here it is, it 2005 Subaru Impreza. That's the one I use uh, for the trial. It's a very good car. I completely got wrong with the Mitsubishi, but this is the car that I take for that. Then, here we have the showcase. It's the Isha's taxi that we never got. Um, you just need to drive it and be first of the train. Then playgrounds, we can win the Volkswagen Golf 2010. Now, what can we use for all that? Let's have a look. 
it's here reasonable price car and c-class now i'll go to there so you see all cars so i can tell you what i recommend and what i'm gonna use but the trial and uh playgrounds i will do on the stream later on on twitch so hopefully everybody comes have a look now you can see there are many cars that you can actually use um I have that one tuned that's actually pretty fast so I'm probably gonna take that one um, what else is there good uh, the Honda is also not bad the Ford is also not bad but I'm gonna take this one it's funny that I take this one but it's actually really good the Legacy RS is also a very good car in C-Class then let's go to the next one. Um, PR stunt, there you go. So here we have a street scene A800 modern muscle car. What car do I take for that? So let's go to A class modern muscle. There you go. Now, I'm taking the car that I always take. It's a Ford Mustang GT 2018. Why? It's fast and it's grippy and it handles very well. You can also use this car. It's not bad, but I just stick to this car. Um, I actually use both, but for some reason, I always go back to this car. So, I recommend this one. Now, what can we win from that? We win the 1996 Chevy Impala. Then let's go to the next championship. That is S1 900 Country Germany. Now, what are we going to take for that? It's cross country. So, I'll go to um, country. I'll take S1. So what do you have here? You do have a lot of choices. Um, the thing is, I took, where are you? This one. Why did I take this one? It's fast and it's grippy and it handles very, very well. And it's one of the, well, it's actually best, the best rally car ever in that, well, period. So I took this one. I had no problems winning it. Uh, well, basically my girlfriend drove everything. So she tests my tunes. Uh, this one, definitely use it and try it. Now, what can we win for that? We win the Mercedes AMG E63 S from 2018. And then let's go to this one. This is Sport Utility Heroes A800 on street. Um, Again, why are we doing this on street? Don't ask me why. I don't like it. So let's have a look. Sport utilities. Now here again, it's like last week, I think it was, or the week before. Again, we need to use one of these. Um, this one is not a bad one, but I actually took this one this time. It's fast, it's grippy, and it handles very well. Uh, no problems in um, winning the championship. Now, of course, you can also take this car. I don't have that one tuned, I think. No, I don't. Otherwise, it would be S900. Uh, this is also a good car. The Urus is a good car. This Urus is a good car, but it's car pass, so not everybody has it. The Porsches, they're sliding a little bit, so I do recommend this one. It's also a very cheap one, but you can try other cars. Um, the last week or the week before, I tried other cars also, and they were fine. But the Land Rover is what I preferred this week. Now, what can we win from that? We win the Caddy Escalade. Now, let's go over to the stunts. Nope. I need to put this off. There you go. Here, the first one is a danger sign. It's, uh, well, you can take either the muzzler 
or you can take the hooligan you can also take the hooligan uh, the hooligan rs 200 or you can take any other car that is a little bit decent and fast in cross country i actually just took my muzzler uh where is it i always have there we go now on my first run i was l very lucky because i actually started flying before the um the flag so that was very interesting it is easier to put traction control on with this fast little car and the thing is i always uh this one this time oh there you go my previous one i already was flying actually before it there you go if you want more stable, put traction control on, on that car. Then here, you need to start from, I think I started from this point. Now many people always said, yeah, but I don't have the Hooniken RS200. Uh, no problem. I actually have this one. I just used the Ford RS200. I actually made a video uh, today about it because the car is actually really good. Uh, so definitely have a look at that video if you want. The Hoonigan RS200 is a little bit faster, but you can actually do it with this car. <coughs> there you go. Then the last one is this one. You just need to drive very fast and try not to hit traffic. I actually took my muzzler again for that. There you go. Oh no, wait, 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 wait. You need to start from this side. My apologies. I tried it from the other side, it was also possible, but it was a little bit harder to do. So you need to start from the top. And there you go. That was it. With the muzzle it's always easy to do uh, stuff like that. Then here you have the monthly rivals and the online adventure that they both give you a lot of percentage by the way. Now what do we have here? We have the Lambo Hurricane P and the Ferrari 250 GT. So basically there is not a real new car that we get today. But this one I've been seeing this car on the auction for 20 million. So I guess you can sell this car for 20 million. I also made a video with that car when I went driving with my wheel um, but I'm not getting many views on different videos than my uh, festival playlist videos so I would appreciate it if I get some support on other videos because I'm putting a lot of time and effort in it. Well that's it. I hope my car choices help you get all your cars that you wanted. I'll be streaming tonight on Twitch at 9.30 CST. So hopefully everybody comes join me and we will have fun like we have every week. That's it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.